Fratelli di Zucca is a lovely, soft, chewy pasta filled with sweet roasted pumpkin. And it's a delicious primo from Lombardia. And the first step is making a real quick batch of pasta dough. And in fact, when I make pasta, if I have any left over, I wrap it, put it in the fridge, and it'll keep well for at least three to five days. The technique to making a pasta dough isn't that complicated. Dry ingredients go down, mix thoroughly, and then you work in the wet ingredients. A little water. Pulling the dry dough in from the edges. And now the kneading. So it becomes soft, supple, before we let it relax. Okay, my dough now needs to rest, gives me a chance to clean up, and then on with the filling. My pumpkin has been slowly roasting so that it starts to really intensify in terms of all its juices, sugary sweetness, while keeping that wonderful bright orange color. And because there's a little extra moisture in this roasted pumpkin, I'm just gonna hang it in this strainer so some of those juices drain out. Because it's important to have the filling for the tortelli not be too wet. Tortelli are ready to be filled. So just enough filling to fold them in half and seal them well, using a little water to moisten the edge. Pressing down so they have a firm seal, and the filling is all about that soft, creamy, roasted, slightly sweet pumpkin, seasoned with nutmeg, which is a classic seasoning for this dish the zest of a fresh lemon, and a good amount of Parmigiano-Reggiano. The sauce for the tortelli is really simple. Butter in a good hot pan, and wait till it just starts to turn brown, nut brown. That nutty flavor adds to the walnuts I'm also going to throw into the pan for a little crunch. Finish off a good grating of Parmesan cheese. A classic primo from Lombardia. Tortelli di zucca. And what I love about these tortelli is that you can actually see the filling through the dough, which tells me the dough is super light. And the sauce, so simple to make. This is a delicious. Primo.